All right, so we got to the tail end of everything. We kept on putting our segments in. Uh, every, there's, for the essential graphics, there's four transitions. You can keep going with those. Um, once you make them, if you want it, just go back to the beginning. You can copy that transition so you don't have to do all the uh, colors over again. Just make sure that you go from V1, that is highlighted right here, to V2. And then you can copy and paste that transition and move it around so you don't have to do the colors. So put a transition on all of these. That looks good. Went through. Everyone looked. Boom, boom, boom. At the very end, you have photos of the week. You actually have to go to Envato Elements and get a, um, a piece of audio for this. Um, but that's no problem. The other thing is inside of standards, you're going to find the, the outro song right here. Um, now, here's um, a part. I'm going to upload this, and you can use this as a template. But if you ever need to do the uh, the credits right here, how you do credits is you make a text box. I'm actually in effects right now. It's a little easier. You make a text box. When you make that text box, uh, you can put all of your, um, you put the graphics uh, in, boom, right here. But then you go to your selection tool, click out of it, and when you click out of it, you'll be able to see roll. That's how you create it. And then what a roll is, is however long this is, is it's going to uh, roll. Um, but I'm going to have the template like this, so you can just use this template. You can also use the transitions as this template too. So we are good to go. I do a quick um, command A, select all, right click, and audio gain, normalize all peaks to negative three. Just make sure it goes through. People should already be doing this for their segments, but if there's any little um, any little things that are wrong, uh, it will go in and change those. And the last thing that you do because it inevitably happens every single time. You want to go to the very beginning and watch it. Now, I like to watch it at three times three speed. Uh, well, if it's a 15 minute thing at times three speed, it's going to take five minutes to watch this, okay? But it's super important because this is where you can see if there's anything that's wrong. Transitions are wrong, if things are, if things are bad. So watch this through, I, I guarantee you, that five minutes that you take right now will save you an hour of exporting, uploading, and doing all of that, okay? So you press play. L is the fast forward key. The key L is the fast forward. I hit it three times. Watch it. Go all the way through, all the way to the end. And you know the deal. File, export, media. Change this to, if it's not, H.264. Click this, save it to your finished video, hit save, export, and you're good.